Now here with the fuss, the food fuss enters into the mouth or it is called the buccal cavity. In the buccal cavity we need to know the functions of three. We need to know the function of the teeth, of the tongue and of the saliva. So the teeth we know we bite our food with our teeth and we need to bite our food well, we need to masticate our food well and why is it so? So what does the teeth do? The teeth first, they, it crushes, they crush the food out into small pieces. Now when the food is crushed into small pieces, the surface area now increases. So big pieces of food, like this big large pieces of food, are broken into small many little pieces. Hence the surface area increases. Due to the increase in surface area, the digestion takes place faster. These enzymes can act faster on the food and the digestion is faster, is made faster. So the main function of teeth is to crush the food, make the bits into smaller pieces, increase the surface area, and thus hasten digestion. Now we go to the next and that is the tongue. We have the muscular tongue. Now the muscular tongue helps the food to move around in the mouth. So as we bite the food, the food keeps moving around the mouth. And in doing so, in moving the food around the mouth, it helps the saliva to mix with the food. Now the function of the saliva it will be the next point. What is the importance of saliva? The third point we come to is saliva. And the saliva has two functions. Number one, it wets the food and it produces a digestive juice called saliva. Now this, this wetting of the food is important because it, it helps in swallowing the food. The food needs to be wet in order to swallow it, in order for it to travel down the alimentary canal. Because the lining of the alimentary canal is very soft. And because the lining is soft, the food should be wet. Dry food has more friction. It's difficult to swallow dry food. So the food should be wet and this is done by the saliva. Now the saliva secretes an enzyme or contains an enzyme called salivary amylase. So let me repeat again, that's a very important function of the salivary gland. It secretes an enzyme called salivary amylase. You can see in this picture the salivary glands. Here we have the We have the salivary glands, you can see you don't need to know these in detail. So there's one salivary gland here, there is more, there are here the salivary glands. And all the salivary glands pour the saliva into the mouth for the digestion. Salivary amylase is an enzyme and it converts the starch that we eat, it converts it into sugars. If you take a piece of bread in your mouth and you keep uh, crushing it or biting it for a long time, mixing it with a lot of saliva, it will turn a little sweet because the starch has turned into sugar in the presence of the amylase or the salivary amylase. So the function of the salivary amylase is to convert starch into sugar.